hello everyone welcome back to my channel service no universe hope you all are doing well today's topic is about the community question that is the real time requirement to show the terms and conditions pop up after the login in the native ui okay let's see the demo first and then we'll discuss how it is implemented okay let me just click on login so as soon as i click on login uh, i'll get this pop up here the terms and conditions pop up and here uh, we have ok button and we have cancel button here okay when the user clicks on ok it means he is accepting the terms and condition and in the user session we are storing that the user uh, the logged in user has accepted the terms and conditions so will not show this pop up again okay but if the user has cancelled this okay if he, if the user has not accepted the terms and conditions for example but if we refresh the page again that pop up will come again here Okay. you see that pop up is coming again but if if he clicks on okay okay then if i refresh the page again that uh, pop up will not come now okay okay to implement this we have used a global ui script so let me just open that and the ui script name is pop up on login okay now we can see uh, the global is marked here and the ui type set is desktop so it will work on native ui we can create the ui script for mobile or service portal uh, ui uh, then we need to embed this ui script in the widget dependency in the uh, widget side so we'll discuss that in our upcoming videos okay but currently we have created a global ui script and uh, we have marked this global checkbox here and ui type is desktop so that it will work on native ui okay now let's see how the script is working here so i'll come to this glide ajax later but we'll see here uh, we have used the glide dialog window to uh, show the pop-up and we have used the ui page inside it so let me go to the ui page okay this is the ui page and here in the html side we have added the terms and condition and we have added the ok button here okay and on click of ok button we are triggering a client script function and that is calling uh, a script include this is that is session util through glide ajax okay and there we are calling the function called set terms and condition in the session okay now let me just go to that uh, script include this is session util script include and in this uh, this uh, function is called what we are doing here is we are just getting the logged in user session and in that session we are uh, adding one variable using put client data function and that variable we are setting it as true okay because uh, the user has clicked on okay okay it means he has uh, accepted the terms and condition that's why we are putting the uh, terms and condition accepted as true here okay so after we uh, uh, in the response we are closing that okay when the user clicks on okay we are just closing the uh, pop-up okay now let me just go back again here okay now when we are showing this pop-up when we are uh, first we are checking whether we need to show the pop-up or not okay if the user has already accepted the terms and condition then we don't need to show it again and again right so we did we need to show it only once per session okay if i log out and then again log in back then we need to show that a uh, pop-up once once per session that's why what we are checking is whether the user has already accepted the terms and condition or not that's why we are calling the glide ajax here again uh, we are uh, using the same script include and here we are checking show terms and condition okay and here uh, we are calling one more function get terms and condition from the session okay and here we are reading the uh, we are just calling we are just calling that session and we are reading the value which we set previously from the session using the get client data function okay now as we have already clicked on okay this uh, variable already contains true now okay now we we, uh, we we are back here in this function show terms and condition as this is true uh, because terms and conditions are already accepted what we are showing is don't show the pop-up now so we are returning false from here if terms and conditions are not accepted then uh, we would have uh, returned uh, returned true here then uh, here in the callback function of this glide ajax we are checking if the answer is true if we need to show the pop-up then only we are showing it if we don't need to show the pop-up then we are not showing this okay so this is how we are using a uh, ui script and glide dialog window and script include to show the pop-up after the login page and showing the terms and condition okay now we can use this same logic to show the cookie consent on the native ui after the login here in this case we are storing the user's response in the session variable but in cookie consent case we can store the user's response in the browser cookies okay. and one thing to remember when we are using the global ui script this global ui script uh, script get attached to all the pages opened in the native ui that's why we must add the code here which should which should quickly execute 
okay here uh, the code added should not take more long time because if the code added here takes time then it will hamper the performance of the instance okay so this is all about the uh, pop-up on login i uh, hope you understood this if you like this video then please hit the thumb icon and add your valuable suggestions in comment and uh, if you're not yet subscribed to the channel then please do subscribe thank you